After four decades serving as a local councillor, Mike Hancock is no longer a member of the Liberal Democrats on Portsmouth Council. He's also been an MP for over 19 years, but he voluntarily resigned his party whip at Westminster last year to contest allegations of sexual impropriety. But he continued to serve as a Lib Dem councillor until Wednesday, when he was suspended following the leak of a report into the allegations against a female constituent. She initially approached the MP, but said she was soon overwhelmed by his visits to her house and intimate text messages. Speaking last summer, she described her feeling of helplessness. The things that he had asked me to do, and because he's in a position of trust, he's just overstepped the mark, and I just feel like no one's listened to me for three years. His alleged victim will be here at the High Court later, demanding to see a copy of the report carried out by an eminent QC. The council argues that it's not necessary or appropriate to release the findings of the report. But all of this is increasing pressure on the Liberal Democrat leader, Nick Clegg. Critics say he should have acted much more quickly. My first reaction was, like anybody's reaction, was to be appalled by the seriousness of these allegations. And my second instinct was to react immediately, which is why it was then looked into and why Mike Hancock ceased to be a Liberal Democrat MP and has now been suspended from the party altogether. A police investigation into the claims, which Mr Hancock denies, found that no further action should be taken. This comes after a difficult week for Nick Clegg. He's faced a split in his party over complaints against its former chief executive, Lord Renard, which he also denies. Mr Clegg has already admitted the party's handling of the Renard situation was messy and said the party must now introduce a new culture when it comes to the treatment of women. Louise Stewart, BBC News.